Today on In Your Face Anatomy, we are looking at the femur, which is the longest bone in the body. Hold your jokes. All right, let's get into it. Good luck. Next up, we've got the femur. So with my femur, there's a couple of things I need to know. Some of them are, are pretty obvious a little bit. A few of them are, are a little bit more complicated. So the first thing we got is the femoral head. So that's clearly this round part here. This is my femoral head. This is the neck of my femur right behind it. So we go head, we go neck, femoral head, femoral neck. Then I've got the fovea capitis. Well, in the head of my femur, I've got this little indentation here in the bone. Get my big fat fingers out of the way right there. So this is my fovea capitis. Capitis means head, like tinea capitis was ringworm on the head. Fovea capitis is this little indentation in the head of my femur. And we're going to help uh, use that to anchor the femur into place when we plug it into our pelvis to make our hip joint. Then I've got my greater and lesser trochanter. So on my fem femur, much easier, greater trochanter, um, nice, big, clearly higher, lesser trochanter, smaller, more subtle, and a little bit lower. So don't confuse these with the greater and lesser tubercles. Those were on the humerus. With the femur, we call them trochanter. So my greater trochanter and my lesser trochanter. Then I've got my uh, medial and lateral condyles and medial and lateral epicondyles. So with my distal end of my femur down here, these are my condyles here and here. And then my epicondyles are on each side. So before we can determine which one is medial, which is lateral, we need to understand, is this a left femur or a right femur? Well, if I pull out the pelvis here, we can see the femur has to plug in to either here or here, here or here. So we can't tell from the top of our femur, but we can from the bottom because one side is flat, the other side has these condyles sticking up. And our knee only bends one direction. It only goes backwards. So my condyles have to go in the back of my legs. It's the back of my knee, and my femur has to plug in this way. So if I try it on this side, nope, that's not going to work because that means my, bees, uh, my knee is bending the wrong way. So the only way this works to get my femur plugged in there and the condyles in the back, this has to be a left femur. This is a left femur. Now that I know this is a left femur, I can flip it over and say this is the medial condyle because it's going to be on the medial side. Medial condyle also lines up with what side the head is on. The head is facing. So my medial condyle, my lateral condyle. So to wrap this all up, lateral epicondyle, lateral condyle, medial condyle, medial epicondyle as we work our way around the bone. And that is it for the femur. Pretty easy. Good luck.